welcome back. So this is Maria. Today is such a special day. Today we are celebrating the Star Spangled Banner. It was the day, September 14, 1814, that Francis Scott Key from the state of Maryland wrote the beautiful words of the Star Spangled Banner, the nation's the United States anthem. Francis Scott Key wrote the words to the Star Spangled Banner as a poem, and then it was um, set to music by a British composer, John Smith. That's right. The music was by a British composer, John Smith. And the battle, when um, Francis Scott Key wrote the words to the Star Spangled Banner as a poem, it was between the United States and England, the British. When you hear British, think England or Britain. And um, so on September 14, Francis Scott Key, very early in the morning during dawn's dawn, D-A-W-N, dawn's early light between 5 in the morning or 4 and 6, dawn's early light, Francis Scott Key saw the Star Spangled Banner standing after a night of such a battle, of wars, of um, bombs bursting in the air. And the rocket's red glare gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. He called it the Star Spangled Banner. And what is a banner? A flag. A banner is a flag. And of course the stars for the 50 states, each star, star spangled. Think glittery, shiny, shiny and glittery. And um, he wrote more than one verse because at, he was in a ship when he wrote the words, Oh, say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming. Um, he just grabbed a pencil and started writing those words. Later on, when he got to his hotel, he finished writing the poem the poem that became the national anthem when it was set to music and in 1931 Congress officially approved the Star Spangled Banner as the song for the United States of America, the national anthem. And I think of um, the words um, that I wrote that I, I was so inspired by Francis Scott Key and other American patriots like Dr. Martin Luther King Right? and Frederick Douglass, and Elizabeth Stanton, and Susan B. Anthony, with the words, um, the brave mantle of the red, white, and blue, the Star Spangled Banner, will stand by its truth to protect, defend, and preserve the land of the brave, the land of the free, that breathes life to the American dream. Believe that with all your heart. So we're going to sing so we can remember that on September 14th, 1814, Francis Scott Key wrote the words, the Star Spangled Banner, as a poem. On September 14th of 1814, Francis Scott Key wrote a special poem. A Star Spangled Banner, the Star Spangled Banner. We hope you enjoyed this class. It's a special day, the Star Spangled Banners Day. See you next time.